Hi guys, I'm Chloe with Body Art Forms, and today I'm here to talk to you about anodizing. Anodizing is a process where titanium or niobium jewelry is immersed into an electrolytic bath, which then has an electric current pass through it. This causes a thin oxide layer to form on the surface of the metal. The higher the voltage, the thicker the oxide layer. There are two different types of anodizing that are most commonly used for body jewelry. The first process that helps strengthen the jewelry and make it more resistant to humidity, uh, high heat, salt water, and general wear and tear. This added durability is of course great for body jewelry, but is also commonly used for machine parts and heavy duty equipment that will see a lot of stress and wear. The second type of anodizing most commonly seen in body jewelry is a process which changes the color of the metal. This color shift is achieved by the same electrolytic process we explained, and the thickness of the oxide layer determines the color. The different colors are created when the light passes through the oxide layer and is refracted back, meaning the hue is determined by how thick the oxide layer is. This allows for a wide array of bright colors to be added to the metal. A few things to keep in mind is it's important to note that the color of the jewelry can always move further up the spectrum by adding more voltage and thus a thicker oxide layer but cannot go back. Also, while the process can create a wide variety of colors, it does have its limits. Red, black, and white are not colors that can be created by the way of anodization, along with pastel hues and matte finishes. Most sites, ours included, will offer color charts to help you see what are available. Lastly, it's worth noting that anodization is not a permanent color. It can change, fade, or come off over time due to the oils on your skin, cleaning, chemicals, or how often you wear or touch the piece, all of which gradually removes that oxide layer. This is the nature of anodization and happens due to the natural wear and tear, and it is not a sign of defect or damage. So what are the benefits of coloring jewelry this way? For starters, this process allows you to customize your titanium or niobium jewelry to match your personal style. The wide array of bright colors available, there's always something for everyone. You can really change the look of a piece. Secondly, titanium is a low reactive of metal, meaning it is less irritating and perfect for people who have more sensitive skin or fresh piercings, but still want that pop of color. We here at Body Art Firms also offer our own in-house anodizing service. If you want to customize a piece, just search our titanium or niobium products and look for the optional color add-on drop-down. You can select one of our colors offered when ordering your piece and we'll anodize it for you before shipping it out. We hope this has been informative. As always, please remember to like and subscribe and follow us on our socials at Body Art Forms.